What's up guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are bringing you the 10 of the most ugliest dogs that the planet Earth has ever seen. These dogs are still lovable though, meaning we are just here for laughs. So without any further ado, let's get started with today's list. Number 10. The Napolitan Mastiff Our first pick should set a precedent for what's to come, as the Napolitan Mastiff is definitely one of the most well-known and popular dogs in the world. We may not know its exact name, but we're all familiar with this droopy, layered fur coat that this dog breed is famous for. This dog actually has a solid cult following too, meaning it's definitely not on the list because people hate it. As we've said before, people actually love it. But preferences among people may vary, and with this dog being at the very extreme end of the droopy dog community, it gets the ugly treatment that very few other dogs get. In spite of its unorthodox look, however, the Napoleon Mastiff is actually an incredible pet. As the puppies are friendly and easy to train while the adults are protective and obedient, it's a surprisingly docile dog. For the impression it looks, can give off, but that's not what the list is for, meaning our furry little friend sits comfortably at number 10. Number 9. The Chihuahua Wait, aren't Chihuahuas one of the smallest dog breeds in the world? Small animals are supposed to be cute, not ugly. This is probably the first thing that came to your mind upon hearing this name, and you're not far off. As many people do choose Chihuahuas for their pets because of their small size, and the idea of small equals cute is something we've all almost learned from experience, but have you ever interacted with a Chihuahua that doesn't know you too well? If you have, it might explain why this dog at number 9 on our list of ugly dogs. This dog is scary. The Chihuahua looks like a zombified version of a Pomeranian, with its big, creepy eyes and slim build. It doesn't look, uh, stable. Chihuahuas don't emit the same feeling of warmth that other dogs do, and the fact that they are so small makes them wary and quick to startle, which is not a thing you want from a dog with sharp canines. Chihuahuas also have a massive fan following, but compared to the other warm, fuzzy, wholesome dogs out there, doesn't manage to escape the number 9 spot on today's list. Number 8. The English Bull Terrier The English Bull Terrier, well, isn't the most charming fellow you'll ever meet. They can be cute to some people, and to dogs on this list, they can be, but the number of people who genuinely like this breed is close to nothing. This dog looks like a cow. It almost breaks our scientific idea that herbivores have eyes on the sides, while carnivores have eyes in the front. Its head shape is so weird and chunky, it looks like it has sideways herbivore eyes. It does have one-of-a-kind triangular eyes being the only recognized dog breed to have them, but particularly they're still the regular forward-facing eyes. This makes the dog as a whole look more like a science experiment than a dog, which although many people love is not the most popular choice, which is why the English Bull Terrier is number 8 on today's list. Number 7. The Irish Wolfhound The Irish Wolfhound is one of the trickiest cases in this video. That's because it doesn't exactly look ugly, it looks unhygienic. Many Irish Wolfhounds share the same fur color as the Grey Wolf, which we all know doesn't look the most appealing. Combine that with its hairy build and you may realize just why people prefer other dog breeds over it. It looks like the hobo of the dog world. This is an extremely harsh review for a dog, but that's what today's video is all about. By the way, be sure to write your own opinions down in the comments section below. We'd love to hear your take on this topic. The Irish Wolfhound is by average the tallest of all dog breeds, which adds to its scrawny appearance. But it's a good pet and has a kind heart, meaning even the seventh ugliest dog has no issues finding affection and a loving home among humans. Number 6. The Chinese Sharpe This pick does not need much explanation, especially after the Neapolitan Mastiff. Do you remember the sheer number of flabs we saw in our number 10 pick? Now it's time to take that number and multiply it several times over. We bring you the Chinese Sharpe, a dog breed with so many flabs it looks like a brain. The Chinese Sharpe looks like a Jenga tower with a head. We can imagine just how cuddly this furry dog would be, but that doesn't take away the fact that half of its fur doesn't even see the daylight. It's always covered. The Sharpe is again a great pet and can justifiably be on someone's top 10 cutest dog list. But just how extremes go and with this dog breed not being the preference of many, it claims the number 6 spot of today's list. Number 5. The Pulley Have you seen a mop? Yeah, that's basically what a pulley dog looks like. There isn't really much to say about it except that it might be the most unique dog breed in today's video. You can look at it in two ways, one being a dog with dreadlocks and two being a mop. Honestly, neither opinion feels appealing for a dog. And that's basically why number 5 on this list. The dog's face is actually one of the cutest faces you've ever seen, and apart from the hair, the dog is actually quite beautiful. But since you can only see the outer locks 90% of the time, it makes this dog a very niche dog for pet owners. 
definitely a deserving pick for the list, but still cute enough to be loved and adored by us all. Number 4. The Borzoi Up next we have the Borzoi, a symbol of the Russian aristocracy. They are hunting dogs, especially good at their job as well as sprinting and having disproportionate heads? Yeah, Borzois isn't the most graceful dog you've ever seen. They have the same issue as the Irish Wolfhound in that they look extremely untidy. Their fur always looks like it hasn't been washed in days. But no one thinks about it much. After all, who cares about fur when the dog's head looks like an accidental sentence writing with a caps lock on? The head looks too small for the body while also being so thin and long that it makes the dog's face look like a goat's. The Borzoi is a weird looking dog and although people love them all the more for it, it still snags the number 4 spot in today's list. Number 3. The Bedlington Terrier Now is the time for the dog that looks the least like a dog and oh boy it looks absolutely hideous at first sight. Presenting to you the Bedlington Terrier. This dog right here looks wrong. The Bedlington Terrier looks like a cotton toy made with an illegitimate toy manufacturer. It simply isn't right. It doesn't look like a dog at all. No one in their right minds would realize that it's a dog at first sight. The Bedlington Terrier, which looks more like a disabled goat than a dog, is definitely an awkward looking animal. But it isn't straight up ugly either, is it? The Bedlington Terrier was a difficult pick but after long deliberation we've placed it at number 3 on today's list. Number 2. The Mexican Hairless well, this dog doesn't need too much PR. It's already represented by adorable Dante from Disney's Coco. Everyone who's seen the movie is a big fan of Dante, and by extension, the Mexican hairless dog breed. But wait, isn't this a list of ugly dogs? What's the adorable Dante doing here? Well, we can only answer that question by saying that Pixar's incredible character design doesn't capture the exact essence of a Mexican hairless. The actual essence that is captured by photos of this dog breed isn't as warm and exciting. These dogs have a smooth, shiny body which is already a red flag for many dog lovers. This plus the dry colors that dog have, not to mention the adherent spots that some dogs in this breed have, make them quite an ugly option in the eyes of many. But now we have the final one. The dog that makes all the other dog breeds look like princesses of Troy. That dog is number one, the Chinese Crested. The Chinese Crested is a hairless dog breed meaning it can come in two varieties with hair and without hair. The with hair variety is called the Power Puff variety which is one of the most cuddly, floofy, attractive breeds we've ever seen. The hairless variety however looks like a complete eyesore. The worst part about it is that it's not completely hairless, it has hair on its paws and its tail which is still cute but it has hair on its head. Its long hair actually makes this breed look like a human sometimes. Which is why it's much worse than it sounds. The Chinese crested dog is infamous for being the ugliest dog in the world. And even though we tried to challenge that notion, we couldn't find nearly enough reason to justify not putting it at number one spot for today's list. And that's the end for today's video. We hope you liked our content. And if you did, be sure to give us a like, hit the notification bell, and don't miss out on another video. Thank you for watching.